Cause the feeling's coming on too strong When your heart has given up And your soul has had enough Raise your glass and make a toast To the ones, to the ones we hate the most probably tell by the title of this video it is going to be a little bit different than what I usually do here on my channel and it's not beauty related it's actually going to be an Aldi's grocery store haul so if you know me personally or if you've been following me on Instagram for the past year or so then you know that I have been doing the low carb slash keto diet so I'm just a little burnt out on that diet and I just want to do something different and fresh and just try a whole new diet so what I'm gonna do is just simply try to eat healthier like I'm going to do some portion controls. I'm gonna look at the calorie intake. I'm also still gonna be looking at the carb intake, but I'm not just gonna be obsessed with everything. Like, I was so obsessed with the diet that I was on and strict that I wouldn't even let myself eat corn if I wanted corn or if something had corn inside of it, I wouldn't eat it. I didn't do potatoes, of course. I didn't do bread. I wouldn't even eat fruit because of the sugar in it. And I just feel like my mentality and my mindset on a diet was just starting to get really unhealthy and honestly making me miserable. So I just want to do something clean and fresh and also I'm going to incorporate going back into the gym. I used to go to the gym religiously and somehow I just fell out of doing that but I'm going to try to go back into the gym. I'm going to start running and doing cardio. But so now I wouldn't really say that I'm like on a specific diet. I'm just going to be watching what I eat and I'm also going to try to cut all the processed food and try to do as much organic food as I can get. But I put a poll up on my Instagram stories and asked you guys who would be interested in if I added some different content to my channel, including a grocery store haul. And 100% of you guys voted yes, that you want to see this up on my channel. And I also put up a question on my stories and asked if you would rather me go to Trader Joe's, Whole Foods, Walmart, Kroger, or Aldi's. And I would say about 90% of the people voted Aldi's. So that's where I went. So I ended up going to Aldi's, but as you guys can see, I already have my groceries unloaded and they're already out on the counter ready for me to go through them with you guys. But before we start this video, if you have not already, then please hit that subscribe button. And if you do like this video, then please give it a thumbs up and then we'll go ahead and get started and see what I got today at Aldi's. All right, so before I get started, I just wanna go ahead and point out that I'm not doing any of this stuff in any kind of specific order. I kind of have things grouped together just because of the way that I bag them. But besides that, I kind of have random things spread across my counter. But I'm just gonna go ahead and jump on into it. First, starting off with the celery. So I got some celery and I got some organic baby carrots. I'm going to dip this in ranch and use this as snacks. Also got a case of water, as you guys can see. All right, so I have this baby spinach, and this is organic as well. I was really surprised by how many organic options that they had today at Aldi's, but I'm just gonna use this to make a salad with. Um, I got some strawberries, which is my favorite fruit ever. I got some bananas. I got a couple of avocados because I'm gonna try to do some avocado toast because I haven't tried that before because I literally was on the no carb diet, so AKA no bread. But I'm excited to have this diet because I feel like I can incorporate some fun and healthy things with this diet. But I'm definitely gonna make some avocado toast using that. I got me a watermelon. I got some of these 90 calorie soft baked bars and this is in the flavor cinnamon coffee cake. Um, yum, that sounds delicious. But I'm really excited to try these out. These look really good. All right, so I got these Kodiak cakes, power cakes. My sister always eats these. She's been eating these for years and I've never tried one because again, I've been on the low carb diet and I could not ever trust something like this on that diet, but I'm excited that I can kind of add some more things into my diet. All right, so now I have this organic whole wheat spaghetti. I'm gonna make spaghetti with it one night or even just any kind of pasta with it. 
All right, so next I got these chia seeds or chai. I'm not really sure how you pronounce that, honestly. My sister told me I needed to add these into my diet because they're really good for you. So I should look into that, I guess. But she said that it would be good to add to some of my smoothies and I start making smoothies. So next I got a pineapple and then I got some organic apple juice. All right, so this section right here is kind of like the dairy section, I guess. It's the way I bagged it. But I got two of these Greek 100 calorie yogurt and it's blueberry and strawberry. I love me some yogurt, so I'm excited to try those out. I got some Mexican style cheese, sour cream. All right, so I got this. I'm just gonna put it right here because I'm really not sure on how you pronounce this word and I don't even wanna try to mess that up. But apparently it's like a healthy substitute for cream cheese. So I'm gonna try this out. I got two packs of that. I got some pimento cheese and I'm going to put this inside of the celery. It's actually really good. I didn't even think I liked pimento cheese until I tried it like that one time at a party. And it was super good. And I've been craving it ever since. So I got some pimento cheese to do with the celery. I found this organic Colby Jack cheese slices. So for sandwiches, burgers, or anything, it's good to have some organic cheese. All right, so next I got these mini Baby Bell cheeses. I'm gonna use these as a snack as well. I got some shelled pistachios. I got some feta cheese. I love feta cheese on a salad. I like making like Greek style salads with this and I found this one and it has reduced fat. So that's a plus. I got some strawberry cream cheese spread and side note, I really wanted to get some whole wheat bagels but Aldi didn't have them, so I went ahead and got this, and I'll probably just go back to the store tomorrow and grab a few of the things that I've noticed that Aldi didn't have that I wanted. All right, so I got some 2% milk, and I also got some unsweetened vanilla almond milk. I'm going to use that for whatever. This is really for Justin, because he really does like some milk. But I got this, and I'm going to try an Active Vitality cereal. It's vanilla almond flavored and I just saw right here it says compared to special K vanilla almond cereal which is the reason I got this because I do like the special K cereal that reminded me of this so hopefully it tastes the same I got three cans of corn I have two of the cream stall and one whole kernel I have a lot of green beans and stuff already in the pantry so I just went ahead and picked up some corn all right so moving on I picked up a few bags a few different bags and I just realized I got two things of blueberries I did not mean to do that but I got a few bags of frozen fruit because I wanna to try to start making smoothies at home. So if any of you guys have any good smoothie recipes that you make on your own at home, then please let me know. So I got the mixed fruit one. This one has strawberries, pineapple, mango, and peaches in it. These are the two blueberry ones. And then I got a strawberry as well. I love me a strawberry banana smoothie. So I'm probably gonna use these, some of the bananas that I showed you guys just a little bit ago and try to make a strawberry banana smoothie. So if you have any good recipes, hit me up. I also got some shrimp. Justin loves shrimp. So I'm gonna try to make something with this. So I got blue corn chips, which I know I probably shouldn't be eating chips, but instead of getting the regular tortilla chips that I keep at home normally, I just replaced them with some organic blue corn ones. All right, so next I got two packs of this Fit and Active rice snacks. So I guess they're like little rice cake snacks. I got a caramel flavor and I also got the cheddar cheese flavor. These are gonna replace chips all alone. Sorry, Justin, but there's no more Doritos, no more chip. Literally trying to get both of us to start being healthy. So hopefully he likes these. I have also never tried this before either. I hear a lot of rave about this product, the Boom Chicka Pop. I got the sweet and salty kettle corn flavor and I also got the sea salt popcorn flavor. Next, I'm really not sure how healthy this is, but it said fit and active on it, so it has to be kind of healthy, right? I'm just kidding, but seriously, it says it has low sodium, low cholesterol, all that stuff, but it's just like chocolate fudge, low fat ice cream bars. Let's see, 100 calories per bar, so that's not bad. So, got that. Okay, so next, I got these sweet potato waffle cut french fries. I'm not really sure how these are gonna taste. I'm not a sweet potato person, but I'm trying to do healthier options. And then I got a pack of chicken, and it comes with five pretty big size chicken breasts, and it was only 11.61. but me and Justin love chicken, so I'm definitely going to be making a lot of chicken dishes with this. And then, 
last but not least, I got some honey wheat bread. All right, so that is all the stuff that I got today from Aldi's. I only spent $108, which is super surprising to me. I just knew it was gonna be over 200 because I got a lot of organic stuff and their organic stuff is pricier than the regular stuff, of course. But yeah, I did not expect it to be that cheap. So I'm super happy about all that. But yeah, so I'm definitely going to be creating new recipes, new snack ideas, lunches and dinners. And if you guys are not following me on Instagram, then go ahead and do so. I'll just leave my Instagram handle somewhere here on this page. And yeah, definitely give me a follow if you're not following me already. I'll try to keep you guys updated with healthy snacks and lunch and ideas and stuff like that. That concludes it for today's video. If you guys liked it, then please give me a thumbs up. And if you're not already, then please hit that subscribe button. And until then, I will see you guys next time. Bye.